On the upside, I did get a few things from TJ Maxx for the dogs, so let me show you. Good evening, internet friends. How are we doing today? None of the dogs are in here. They're outside of my dad. Um, I've been good. It's been an interesting morning, day, whatever. Which is why I didn't pick up the camera until 4.18. Exciting. So, woke up at like 6.30 to take the dogs out. Mom was going to go and leave to go to with her running friends to this race that they're doing tomorrow. But she realized she locked her keys in the car. The only other person who had a copy of her key was my dad. And he was in Chattanooga with a fishing tournament. So, at around 7 in the morning, I got to drive Mom to Chattanooga. Which was fun. We had a little bit of girl time. So, yay. Um, so, got the keys, got back home. I ended up napping for like three hours. So, I was like, well, dang it. And there's a lot of errands I need to get done, which right now, like right after I finish recording this, I'm going to be getting ready to go on my errands. Um, but yeah, I woke up and then took dogs out. Had to get on to the boys because they tried to get ducklings again, which was horrible, but the ducklings are okay. I cleared the mama duck's nest of any rotten eggs. She doesn't know about that yet. Um, out of the seven eggs remaining, four of them are dead and smell horrible, so I had to get rid of them. Um, three of them, I'm hoping, are still alive. They did not smell as weird. And yes, I flat out smelled each egg. Judge me all you want, my friends. But sometimes just smelling is a way to know whether something's alive or dead or infected or whatever. That's something I learned from a vet a long time ago. Um... And then apparently, Riddler and Emerald found a dead snake out in the pasture. And Riddler thought it'd be a great idea to roll in it. So, he got a bath. <laughs> um, and then, I need to brush his and Emerald's teeth because their breaths are horrible. And now Riddler's collar is in the washing machine because it smells. And I've got essential oils going in my room because they made my room smell. Great. But... At least, dead snake smelled better than dead eggs. Joy. Um, but what are the errands I have to do? I have to go by the preschool and pick up my paycheck. Because I didn't get to get it Friday since I went to work with Blue Buffalo. I need to go by the bank. I need to go looking for a dress shirt for my interview with for the chemist position on Friday. Okay, so that was my brother kind of staring at me through a door. That was not creepy at all. Uh, but, um, what else was I going to do? Um, I may, I need to go and see about getting a key made for my mom. Get a couple of backup keys. Um, and then we're going to go to Panda for dinner. Of course, Panda's the best. I really, I hate shopping for clothes. I'll say that. Because I have such body insecurities. So I'm just like, oh, goody. And of course, with women's clothing, especially, it will fit your chest one way and your body a different way. Or like, you know, you find a nice button up and you're like, oh, this is cute. And then it's just like, gap. And it's just like, hi, world, let me show you my boobs. Yay. Not really. Um, so clothing shopping will be a challenge. Though I kind of want to see, I'm going to be going to TJ Maxx, so I may see... If they have, like, any cute, like, storage things. Because I want to find a new way to store MRL's toys and treats and other stuff. <laughs> so, we'll see if there's any cute things over there. And, of course, that's my favorite section to TJ Maxx is the home improvement section. Why? I don't know. So, whenever I have my own house someday, it's going to be decorated very strangely. Because I like home decoration stuff. Go figure. So, now, waiting for yesterday's vlog to upload... And I'm going to get ready to go on our many errands. And I'll check back in with you guys later. Hey guys! So Tyler and I are back from our errand adventures. Woo! So, um, got my paycheck. Got to put it into my account. 
I didn't get my meds. They're not going to be filled till tomorrow, so that's that. Got dinner, went to TJ Maxx and Kohl's. Unfortunately, did not find any business tops, and I need the I need one for my interview on Friday. But I couldn't. It was either I couldn't find a style I liked because I was looking for comfortable. And in a color other than black because my pants are black. And that would match black. <laughs> and then I had four that I liked and I tried them on and they all made me look fat and pregnant. And I'm just like, well, goody. Downside with, you guys don't see this much, but I've got big boobs. There you go. See, ta-da, done. Anyway. So if I wear like flowy tops, they will stick out. Like, it'll look fine up top, but then when you get to my stomach, I look pregnant. I look fat. I'm just like, well, great. So, on the upside, I did get a few things from TJ Maxx for the dogs. So, let me show you. Alright, first item is this cool sign. My dog thinks I'm awesome. Because he does. And then I got this storage cube to store their toys. I've been inspired by Slice of Lime, and I'm going to teach my dog how to clean up his toys. And then this magical box, it's got a little bit of damage, but I got the price reduced for that. It's going to be used to store all of this crap in. Not that. Oh. But like all of his training stuff and his bath stuff and whatever shall be stored in this box. So let me just get it all nice and set up and I'll show you guys what it looks like. All right. So now I'm going to reveal to you Emerald's new stored stuff. So here's the first one. It's just his toys in a box. I don't think he's figured that out. Wait, what's in there, buddy? What's in the box? What do you think? Hey, there's nothing in those boxes. Those are your puzzle boxes. But hey, what's in there, Sassafras? Emerald, come here. Come get a toy. Get a toy. Yeah, those are your toys in there. Like your ropes and your pretzel. Get your toy out. I know Riddler's outside and he's mad. What do you think, buddy? You want your toy? Get your toy. Get your toy. He's not sure what to think of all of his stuff being in a box. I do have the water buffalo horn still out, though, so that I can encourage him to chew on it. Get a toy. Can you get a toy? Get it! Get it! Get it! Get it! Not the box! Nope, you can't have the box, buddy. What about this one? Can you get it? Yes! Good boy! He's probably going to chew on this box, I'm pretty sure already. So I'm probably going to have to move that somewhere. And then, my favorite part is this. Woohoo! I got this for like 13 bucks at TJ Maxx. But it's worth it. So this is like to store your office supplies, but right now I've got, back here's his logbook, um, service dog inspiration stuff, um, notes and his medical records. This is his bath wipes and a couple of his treats, treat bag, more treats, his brush, dental wipes, and the clippers, nail clippers. I kept out these. For easy access training and then of course my dog thinks I'm awesome what do you think you get a cookie are you wanting to earn a cookie touch yes let's see let's see if you get to earn a cookie let's try something that we've been working on are you ready Emerald. Good boy! Yay! Yes! Good! What good boy? Uh-oh, my notebook fell. What about this one? Emerald. Hey! Hey! I need you to do one more. No, 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 no. Yay! Good boy! Okay. So I think those deserve a lamb lung. One of his favorites. We have to wait. And ah, wait. 
Wait. Get it. Good boy. So yeah, that's one of his new alerts that we're working on is whenever I jiggle my foot. So, yes, that's so good. What a good boy. Okay. <laughs> At this point, this is the, if I keep pawing you, I get treats, right? And of course, we don't want to leave Sassy out, so we're going to give her one too. Rip, Emerald, uh. Here you babe. Mmm. And hold on, let's save one for Rinder because it's going to drive him crazy. All right. Ready? Ready? Rinder! Can you sit? Wait. 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 Get it. Ah! There you go. Good boy. And yes, he's still naked. We're waiting on his collar to dry now. I had to spray it down with Lysol because it still smelled like death. So, yeah, that was my new storage unit. And Emerald showing you his little alert. Hi, Sassy. Hey, baby. Why are you wet? You probably were out in the pond. Sassy, can you show us that you can give me your paw? Hey, hey, hey. Emerald, you're done. Why are you still scratching me? He does this. If he thinks he could get a cookie, then he'll just keep on pawing me like that. Sassy. Oh, buddy, ah, I've asked you to quit. No, sir. Well, uh, yeah. Ritter, your toys are in there. Do you want to get your toy? Do you want to get a toy? No? Well, at least I appreciate the things. That's what matters. Hey, guys. There's Ritter. There's Emerald. And there's Sassy Girl. So... I'm feeling really tired and like super dizzy all of a sudden. I'm not really sure why. Probably I just need to go to sleep. Um, so what else did I do? I did a live stream on Instagram. That's fun. And I talked about how I do plan on... I want to do some kind of live stream on MRL's birthday, which is until October. But I want to do like a live stream birthday party. I think it'd be fun. I don't know 100% the logistics of it yet, but I think it'd be fun. Oh, and I finally got a board to use for my service dog inspiration board. I had to dig through a closet to find it, but I got it. And I realized I want more stuff to cover it. I don't have enough things, but that's okay. Um, <clears throat> and then, let me just tell you guys, BarkBox is awesome. Well, besides all the cool stuff, but I was just talking to one of their um, employees because I was like, I was curious. I was like, I know this theme's, this month's theme was Jurassic Bark. And last month's was Poo York City. But I got the Poo York City box instead of the Jurassic Bark. Why? And it was because it was my first box. But she offered to send me her dog's favorite toy from the Jurassic Bark collection. So yay, Emerald's getting a free toy. I'm pretty excited about that. And then next month I'll be getting June's, I mean July's theme, which... I think I figured out what it is. I kind of got a hint, but I'm not going to tell you guys. Because if you guys are BarkBox subscribers, I'm not going to tell you. Because, let me just say, it'll be fun. I'm pretty excited as to what they're going to do. But, yeah, BarkBox is so nice. They're awesome. And then she showed me how to get MRL involved with the Destroyers Club. Where you can earn points and credits for your dog destroying toys. Yay! Um... So, yeah. Uh, now I'm super exhausted, so I'm going to sign off for the night and head off to bed. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've had a wonderful day or night, rain or shine, whatever the world has for you today. Question of the day is, how do you organize your dog's stuff? Do you have, like, specific boxes? Or do you just, like, throw it around? How do you organize your dog's things? So, put your answers down below, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye! Good night, Riddler! Good night, Emerald. Good night, sassy girl.